Hey guys! Today, I will show you how to use the new transfer animation feature. You will find it on the last version of Bone Dynamics Pro. Here we have a basic animation of a character landing on a platform. We are going to use Bone Dynamics to add a bit of space switching and follow through. As you can see, it was animated using IK Bones, and IK Bones rarely have parents. In the last version of Bone Dynamics, if a bone doesn't have a parent, the add-on automatically transfer the animation to the mesh that controls the bone. So all we have to do is to select the IK bone and hit Add Bone Dynamics. We can also do that for the elbow target. We are going to use the displacement mode, meaning the bone will be allowed to move freely around instead of rotating. The head bone has a parent, so we need to transfer the animation manually by selecting the bone and clicking on Transfer Animation. The transfer animation allows you to transfer the keyframes of a bone to the mesh that controls the same bone, so the physics will react to these keyframes too. Okay, now let's do that for the hip bone. Same as before, let's enable the displacement mode. The hip bone has a parent so Bone Dynamics will not transfer the animation. We need to do that manually. Otherwise it will not take into account the keyframes of the hip bone, and will result in a bad animation like you can see on the screen. And just like that. When we use the transfer animation combined with the displacement mode, we can achieve a more natural motion and reaction of the different body parts. Another cool thing that this feature unlocks is the ability to make bones that has no parents dynamic, like it is shown on the screen. Alright, that's it for today. Thank you for watching and subscribe for more.